What's up, everyone? It's Kanan. It's Jesse. And we are the Geeky Saying Couple, and welcome to our reaction to Ruby, Volume 9, Chapter 6. It's been a wild week. Kruby has been hyping this episode up, telling people to ignore social media. If you could not watch it right away, we just got home from work. We have not been on social media at all today. Because, you know, we don't want to see it before we record. Um, at first, I was not getting my hopes up. But then Aaron decided to post a little something on her Instagram. Just saying, huh, I don't know why, but I just got a feeling tomorrow's going to be a good day. And, like, last night, before even midnight, Bumblebee was trending. Still trying to stay... Calm. And then we see the name of the episode. Confessions in Cumulonimbus Clouds. Try and say that five times really fast. As soon as I saw that title, I was like, get the bumblebee jackets just in case. We've got our balloons hanging. They've been hanging there precariously since, fall, since chapter one. Fix a few balloons. Yes, we had to refix some <laughs> and had to re rig it all back up. But okay, hopefully it goes off without a hitch. You ready? Yes. All right. Uh, 20 minutes. It's a long one. Uh, subscribe, like, uh, share, comment, hit that notification bell. Let's do this. Okay, screaming. Just, just, hold on. Okay, I have a, yeah, okay, this is from John's point of view. After what we saw last episode, we figured that this would happen. Oh, wow. Crescent Rose was going supersonic. John's having a bad day. <coughs> Where am I? Uh, well, a lot of people would say you're in the after, ever after. Some others would say it's hell. <laughs> okay, so John fell last, but hopefully we'll get the... Well, that might explain it. It's a tree with a clock on it. John, don't touch it. You're gonna touch it. Oh crap! So that's what happened. Hey, no, uh, wait. wait, wait, wait! Stop it! Please stop! There was. Okay, that was Team Ruby falling. Oh crap! He broke it. How much time went by? So that's what happened. He literally... I thought maybe I'd never see you again. Oh my gosh. But I knew if I waited long enough... That he bought. He built a house fall. and everything. Just like I did. <laughs> it's... It's really you, right? Oh, John. When I saw you in the market, I... John. It's us. Oh, my gosh. Oh, John. <laughs> <laughs> Little. Oh, he's crying. How did you find us? How are you the rusted knight? And when did you get so... Mature. Oh. <sighs> really, Weiss? Wow. White knight fans are going to be rejoicing. After the rest of us fell... Oh no. I uh guess we've all got a lot of catching up to do. Oh no. She's got two relics now. And with Cinder, the ability to get another. She doesn't know where the beacon relic is. Well, there's that to be thankful for at least. <sighs> we lost Atlas and the relic. But we got everyone out safely. That's gonna send John Ruby even so. farther we down. Their home to save the relic. 
and we failed. Getting everyone out has to count for something. What good is saving anybody if Salem just destroys the world anyway? That's how Ironwood thought. You don't mean that. Are you done? Uh, really? We move before the weather turns, or it's going to take us a lot longer to get to safety. Wow, Sean being the older, grizzled veteran. There will be plenty of time to lick your wounds later. Come on. Okay, this is. So. That is a pretty where jackalope. Where are we going again? My village. Sean has a village. I still can't believe you made it all the way from the Crimson Keep on your own. Not on our own. We had help. Oh. Yeah, where is the cat? I hope the cat is okay. What cat? Uh oh. That cat! Uh oh. <laughs> Oh, whew, I found you. Why is it you always find the thing you're looking for in the very last place you look? Sean! <gasps> oh, my. Oh, boy. It has been an indeterminate amount of time, hasn't it? I have a feeling Jean so, doesn't like the cat. Have you been? Wait, you two know each other? Well, that storm's coming to. quick. From the story. Nah. Oh, John, nah. I think there's a misunderstanding. Whoa. That can get us all out of here. John going a little. Don't have time for this. We've got to get to my village. Don't worry. We don't need a guide. But your friends wanted to go to the tree. That's where you're letting them take you? Well, yeah. That's. That's how Alex got out. Right? You didn't oh. tell them anything. No, that's simply not true. I told them plenty of things. Oh, this cat is anything, getting sus. Lots of somethings. Can somebody please make sense? That tree is death. It absorbs you, takes your memories, and turns you into something else. If you go there, it's going to erase you. Oh, that's not good. Ascension here. That's really what it is. Wait, the tree is what causes ascension? Time that to blow the tree up. List. The roots of the tree. Pretty curious that you neglected to mention that. Oh, excellent punmanship. But you are not from here. It That's Yang, that so. To you guys. Oh, yeah? Then what happened to Lewis? Who? Oh, man. Alex's brother. Ooh, Alex had a brother? Okay. That. That can't be right. She had a brother? Why didn't you mention him? You never asked, silly. It was always Alex this and Alex that. I'm getting that. creeped We've out. We've been following this story the whole time, and it's not even true. Whew. That's a bad storm. Let's go. I've got a plan. A lot of good that's done you after, what, how many years? Can everyone please stop? This is a lot to take in. Oh, huh? well, Ruby's Looks gonna like lose it. stuck at a crossroads, then. No! Ah, oh, crap, did the kid? What happened? Damn it. Oh, Welcome boy. to a thunderstorm. A, uh, weather pattern that creates a physical man. The cat sent them there. Mental or emotional problem. So, we appear to be at a, Wait a minute. Where's Blake and Yang? Literal. <laughs> How perfectly, stupidly ever after it. This place really is the pits. <laughs> the only way out of this Where did Weiss go? And they just, just nonchalant. What? Oh my gosh. Oh, okay, I asked for that. <laughs> Where's Yang? Oh, Ruby's asking Blake? the question. Must have had something bigger to work out. Ah! Oh no! Huh? We're in the clouds. Oh, don't do this. We need to get to that platform. But how do we take the next step? My theory! They're, uh, they're gonna... Okay, calm down. Well, there goes your theory about the pillar being one of the supports. Well, I mean, it's a support to You know, this would go bridge. quicker if you make up your minds. <laughs> Wait, is that saying choose Jean or the cat? The story oh. is both real not 
Did you see that? It all happened. It was summer. Oh, no Penny, no. Oh, why is the sea an atlas? Oh, that's not cool. So, what? She just lied? You have no idea. I waited for you to fall. For years. It but has been somebody years. Somebody else showed up first. It was Alex. And her brother, Louis. Two siblings from Remnant. I told them I was from there, too. I was waiting for my friends. Once oh I started my helping gosh. them, it didn't take long for me to figure out I was in her story. I was the rusted knight. You gotta be kidding me. Things weren't always the same as the book. Like Alex. She wasn't just a little petulant or inconsiderate. Oh my gosh. She was selfish. Wow. Cool. Like this whole world was simply make-believe and the rules didn't apply to her. Typical Ruby. Louis Everything's like the inverted. One. The clever one. We went places she didn't mention in the story. Like the herbalist. Okay. Something changed there. Whatever he said to her. Oh, sh she wasn't the same after that. She lost all trust in us. Started accusing us of things. The more I tried to get the story back on track, the more she distrusted me. Was it my fault? Did I change the story? I, I couldn't even be the make-believe hero. Oh, John. I didn't have time to make it right. She... The rusted knight drank the poison in her stead. What? She said she wouldn't let anyone get in the way of her leaving. That she'd do whatever it takes. And then she was gone. What the hell? So, not exactly my favorite story anymore. I'm I so sorry. I wouldn't blame you. Wait, why don't you trust the cat then? Ah, <sighs> uh, Jean. The cat's role in the Ever After. I figured it out later when the cat came back for me once Alex left. When people lose their way here, the cat convinces them somehow. Either to keep performing their role or to go to the tree and get a new one. Oh my gosh, the cat, the cat is evil. It healing, but it's manipulation. The cat was never helping Alex or you. Their purpose here is to feed the tree. Wow, that's, that's like some little shop of horror Pretty stuff. Sure. Because the cat took Alex and Lewis there. Only one of them made it back to our world. Oh, crap. You gotta give something. That's not good. Okay. Oh, no. <laughs> Don't do this to me! You alright? I'll feel a lot better when we're together on that platform. Oh no! Uh, is it a password or something? Together! Uh, really? Platform. <laughs> no luck? I'm sure you'll figure it out though. You're good at that. Oh you my so? gosh, here we go. Yeah, you've got a really good brain. <laughs> she still sucks at flirting. Okay, that did something. Uh, I talked about you, so... <clears throat> you have cat ears! Yes, we've, kno <laughs> we've known that for a while. I think your cat ears are cute. <laughs> Nailed it! Don't do oh, this to me! I don't know what it... Is I'm gonna throw up! Maybe it's saying things we never said to each other. Oh my god. <laughs> Yang's like you first. I think you're an extraordinary person. We got a song! You're no! Always the first to lighten a situation. No! You act bravely when you're afraid. You do what I... you say. No, don't. Is this it? Is this it? Try to keep up. I like that you've never been intimidated by me. Oh. Even when you didn't like me all that much. Oh my gosh, those I were the days, a weren't they? Of people in general. But you never gave up on them, even when they hurt you. You never give up. Oh my gosh, they're gonna do it! 
Let's make this quicker. Any big truths we haven't dropped on each other yet? Oh, there's the... It's changing! Oh, it's changing! No! What? Why? What? Did you... Just My heart's beating. That didn't say it? Oh. I'm shaking. No! That can't be what this is about. Oh, no! You can't it be what it's about. It's like... Cliff. Yang's scared. And if I do it, I'm just going to fall. The... I think we're already falling. Oh, no! Just the... say it. Oh my! No! What am I going to do it? Is this it? I think I love you. I love you too. Oh no! no. Oh my god! <laughs> Gosh, I can't believe that actually went as planned. Oh, oh my God. <laughs> Bumblebee is canon. We got an I love you and the kid. Okay. Okay. <laughs> you think we can pay attention? Okay. This time you were in the first place I looked, rather than the last. Jean told us. Oh, I thought there was more to the story. You're accusing me of something. Same page now. You're the one who gives afterins to the tree. Why haven't you been telling us the truth? That kind of makes sense, because he gave her back Higgly to the tree. Higgly, I helped them return to the ever after, yes. But you're not afterins. I'm not taking you there to ascend. I'm taking you there because you all have such delightful information for me. You pretended like you'd never heard of the story when you met us. But Jean had already told you. I think old Jean's maybe a few sandberries short of a picnic. Oh, he is being manipulative <laughs> big time. What happened when you took Alex and Lewis to the tree? Oh. I can't. I, I don't know. She had told me she'd take me with her. Through the door to Remnant, but she tricked me. P so Just beings from the Ever After can can go to Remnant. Like Please people. have a little go with them. You only want to use me in the same way I've only seen others as sources for knowledge and entertainment. Where is Little? Well, at least now I know what not to do. Oh, how manipulative! We just want to get home. It. The cat Thank is guilt tripping them. Ruby, Rose, Huntress. <laughs> I'll be on my way now. Did Stay he call Weiss Wise Huntress again? Okay. <clears throat> oh, do they... <laughs> They're still kissing! The leg! Did we miss anything? <laughs> Feels like I've been waiting forever for that. Oh my gosh, John! <laughs> I sense memes. Yes, I do too. <laughs> oh, is this Sean's village? Blake and Yang are together. Oh! <laughs> yes! Hey, <laughs> there's something I've been holding 
down to for you. It was the first thing I Is saw. that could it be? <gasps> Crescent I Rose! I found it. I knew I'd caught back up to the time of my home. Oh, that's not good. Ruby? I never thought I'd see Ruby look at Crescent Rose like hey. that. Thank you, Sean. Has she lost her Don't will to, for everything? Sean, what did happen to Lewis? I think Alex traded him to the tree in order to leave. Oh my gosh. And then she wrote him out of the story. Good night, everyone. That's not good. They're playing the song. Okay, I gotta hear the. They're playing the freaking song. Oh, I. I don't know. I don't know what to say. I just want to listen to it. It's. Oh my gosh. Okay. You know, it, we didn't get into the full Ruby fandom until around Volume Six. Like we we watched it, but we we stayed off the online stuff and all that. And you know, I remember where we were when the whole Blake and Yang and Adam fight happened in Volume Six. We were at Ohio oh, Con, and. I remember being blown away by that volume. And, you know, for the longest time, volume six was my favorite volume. It really seems like since volume six, you know, because Jess is not on Twitter a whole, whole lot. But I tend to be on there a whole lot and interacting with people. And, yeah, I've said some things in the past that I, I shouldn't have. But, you know, I've, I've literally felt like I've been in the trenches for this shit for so long. Volume 6, Volume 7, Volume 8, the two-year hiatus. And I had a feeling, starting with Chapter 1, with how... <sighs> how they started, like how explicitly they had been with Blake and Yang's interactions this volume. And, but like ever since seeing, um, in the trailer that Blake was in the same freaking area that Yang was, it just, it made us hope. I did have that theory that they were on two sides and they were going to join in the middle. <sighs> And I've been saying for many years, you know, the head touches and what we had gotten, that was enough for me to make them canon. But <laughs> to see it finally happen, to see a new song that I'm probably never going to be able to listen to without crying, to seeing them at first jokingly compliment each other, to it becoming more serious... And, you know, it goes with Yang's character for her to have been hesitant because of all the things Yang has put up with in her life. But on the other side, despite everything Blake had been through with Adam and all that, Blake was ready. And, and just not only to get an I love you from both of them, but for us to finally get that freaking kiss, it seems like we have been going uphill for... I mean, we have. We've been going uphill for 10 years <laughs> since Volume 1 because I always loved Blake and Yang from the yellow and black trailers to... I just... Uh, 
I'm almost speechless. Like, do you want to say anything? Because, I mean, we've done that video a long time ago of what Bumblebee means to us. And, like, that seems like it was forever ago. I think it was, like, our 100th video or something yeah, like that. Yeah, and then we did the... We continued with that with by Blake video, and... I also think back to that Ohio Con. Like waking up and like being excited for things like Yang hitting Adam with her bike and all that. Like it, compared to this, yes, it kind of does look like we were get, getting excited for small things, but it was part of some stuff that we never thought we'd see. We never thought during the Adam, Blake, and Yang fight that we would see Adam screaming, what does she even see in you? And then in Volume 7, we all so badly wanted to see Yang compliment Blake's new hairstyle. It happened. Blake got flushed, and Yang panicked. Um, them going out pretty much on a date together, even though we didn't get to see it. Um, volume 8, both of them obviously missing each other, and then their reunion in that. Blake's reaction to Yang falling first to now this uh, it's and like uh, personally in my heart it feels like a chapter of my life is gone is done um like there's real like unless something gets added to their story which i'm sure there will be but this the first chapter of this is finally to a close. The next yeah. is starting. But it's like no more prediction videos. No. <laughs> like we can finally <laughs> step away from those. Um, I've now got to get that bumblebee tattoo because um, I said if if whenever they would kiss, I would get a bumblebee tattoo, and uh, I'm gonna have to do that. And I hate needles. I I'm scared <laughs> to death of them. Um, I can't wait to hear that full song and have like every bit of the lyrics. I can't wait to hear the commentary on this. Um, and not just because of this, though it is a very big reason so far. Volume 9 so far is, come, is starting to be my favorite volume. And um, we're definitely going to have to do something. Definitely going to have to do something, but... I want to say thank you to Monty, thank you to Carrie, Miles, Eddie, Kersey, of course, Barbara, Aaron, I'm sure they are happy about this. Thank you to every member of Kruby that has brought us this magical moment. I, I'm sure it was nerve-wracking as far as uh, how the fandom was going to react to it. Um... I don't know how they've reacted to it, because like I said, I've not been on Twitter all day. Um, but also, thanks to all of you who watch us every week. Um, you all know that we, we've we shipped the bees hardcore ever since we even launched the channel. And, uh, before. Yeah, well, yeah, before. Even before. Yeah, because like... <laughs> we were on Twitter before we launched the channel. But uh, it, it's 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 surreal. I hope this... Pinch me, please. Like, seriously, pinch me. No. Come I on. can't. Okay, I can feel it, so it's not a dream. Uh, so, yeah, that was our reaction. I hope you all enjoyed it. If you did, please hit that subscribe button, hit the notification bell, click that like button, leave us a comment, share this around, because this is probably the most emotional reaction we've ever had. Um, still got four episodes to go, and we've learned something very dark about the Ever After, so... Who knows how that's going to play out, but um, we sincerely hope you all enjoyed it. Please remember, guys, to stay safe out there. Take care of yourselves. This is Kanan. This is Jesse. We love you all very, very much. Love has won. <laughs> Bumblebee is 100% officially canon. canon. We'll see you guys in the next one. Bye. Bye.